What's going on guys? So today's video is going to be a little bit different. I am going to be showing you guys my entire setup. I've been getting a lot of requests to do this. So I figured now is a better time than ever to get this done because I actually really like how my setup looks right now. Bye. no setup without a room so let me show you guys my room first this is my bed it's where the magic happens and then we got a couch some more magic happens anyways what you guys are probably curious about is this big old mess so come over here I'll, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna give you a little hint I'm not gonna show you guys what this is yet but here's a hint 30 series I don't know, wonder what it could be. And moving on from all of this, we have the actual setup. This is what you guys came for. But before I show you guys all of that, this video is sponsored by Dragon City. Dragon City is free to play and available on both Android and iOS, but also on Windows and Amazon. There are hundreds of different dragons to collect. This one is honestly my personal favorite. He looks super cool. All these dragons look super, super cool. There's so many dragons to get. You breed two dragons to get another dragon. So like there's just endless possibilities. Also, if you download the game through the link down below, you will get exclusive rewards rewards like the fire knight dragon you'll get food and gold and that's my gift to you to get started on dragon city and what you do in this game is you feed and train your dragons in order to take them to battle and there's many different pvp modes that let you fight in real time against your friends and on top of that there's events every week that allow you to discover and play new adventures so with all that being said make sure to click the link down below download dragon city for free and get your exclusive reward so now we can finally get into my gaming setup so this is my gaming and recording side as you can tell by the camera right there and my microphone here and this side is strictly for editing I edit all my videos here and record them here also if you know me you know I'm a keyboard and mouse player this sitting on my desk I don't need it so I'm actually gonna be giving this away this is like a super expensive custom scuff controller make sure to watch to the end of the video because I'll tell you guys how to win so this is what the setup looks like when I'm sitting down in it we have two monitors here this one is an Alienware 240 Hertz monitor and this this one is a Asus 144 Hertz monitor and this is obviously my main one that I use for gaming and I have like my recording and discord and stuff on this side now the keyboard is really kind of special so this was sort of a custom build of KBD fans I think and these keycaps alone were like a hundred dollars so I think this whole keyboard setup here alone was like I want to say three hundred dollars maybe I'm not exactly sure how much all this stuff costs so when I when I call something out there will be a little little pop in the bottom that tells you how much I paid for it or how much it's worth so to go along with my keyboard I have a ninja air 58 I've been using this for a really long time with hyperglides of course and that is sitting on a the mousepad company mousepad which I really really like and then we got my microphone right here which is a sure sm 7b this is the microphone that they use for podcasts this is like top of the line professional stuff and this isn't just like a USB mic it's an XLR mic I think I hope I don't sound dumb there but pretty much that goes into my cloud lifter which helps it give it volume and from there goes into my audio interface and from my audio interface goes into my PC and this right here leads to my headphones my DT 990 pros a lot of professionals use this a lot of streamers use these not gonna lie that's why I, I got them I kind of hopped on the bandwagon there and of course you can't forget the camera right there that's the one I use for my face cam the camera I'm using right now is actually a lot more expensive this is my photography slash vlogish camera that I'm using right now and just in case you guys are wondering it is a EOS RP with a Canon 15 to 35 2.8 lens this thing is nuts boys this was mad expensive all right so moving on to the powerhouse this is what you guys are all interested in I did not build it myself but it is custom from NZXT my computer currently has an i7 9700 K a 2080 super and 32 gigabytes of RAM but those are like the main specs obviously water cooled with the AIO or whatever and if you can't already tell I'm not like a huge 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 computer nerd but I, I do know like a little bit and then here's my MacBook Pro which has insane specs it's specced out higher than my actual gaming PC which is just insane we'll get to that we'll get to this side soon but for now since we're on the topic of my PC uh, I guess I should probably tell you guys what's here so in here we have some upgraded parts we're gonna this is gonna be my brand new PC I'm gonna start using this so here's the case and then here's a box I got from a Asus, they really did hook it up. Uh, let's just get into the parts. Oh, 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 God. Oh, oh, no, my PC parts. 
No, oh God, I'm just kidding. There's the PC parts, there's the rest. Let's get into it. Also, if you didn't already catch on, the boxes are already empty. So starting off with the case, they sent me a Lian Li O11 Dynamic. It's way bigger than my current PC. Again, huge shout out to Asus for sending all this out to me. So this is the ROG Strix B450F Gaming 2 motherboard. So what's great about this motherboard is that it has an upgraded VRAM and a bigger heat sink in order to handle the latest Ryzen 5000 series and 3000 series CPUs. And I'm waiting on my CPU to come in, but I'm actually gonna be using this motherboard with my Ryzen 9. 3900X. This is gonna be the first time that I build my own PC. I'm kind of scared. Just take a look at that. Look, look how beautiful that looks. This is gonna be a great upgrade. This is gonna be so nice. And FYI, this also supports USB BIOS flashback, which is super cool, and it's easy to update your BIOS with. So I'm gonna put this back in the box before I break it. This is literally the best motherboard you can get for like a budget build. So next is the 3060 Ti, and Tough Gaming Asus has put a whole like metal casing around it and three fans oh bro this is my first time ever like unboxing parts of like a pc before this is nice this is so nice so this is actually designed to be way more cooler than the previous cards this 3060 ti is more powerful than my 2080 super holy this is beautiful i'm like scared to touch it check that out you got three fans right there to keep it cool bro just look at what's going on in here like what what is all this look that's all for cooling oh my god dude Aces, thank you very much. All right, so this next stuff isn't that important, but again, ROG. This is a 650 watt power supply they sent me. 650 is gonna handle everything very nicely. I don't need to open this up. You guys, you know, it's, it's just a power supply. They sent me two sticks of eight gigabyte DDR4 3200. This is only 16 gigabytes. I'm probably gonna get another pack of this so I can make it a total of 32 gigabytes. And then we have a one terabyte SSD. Thank you, Aces, for sending this stuff out. I cannot wait to build this PC and get started. So moving on to this side we have the nano leaves a little bit overrated they are really cool they add a little nice little backlight right here and that down there is actually my push to talk very very cheap I recommend that everybody watching this video go ahead and grab one of those it's like a super simple way to use a push to talk without like taking your hand off of anything else you need I forgot to mention this earlier too a little stream deck I use that for a soundboard sometimes I'm giving this away soon don't worry I'll tell you guys how to win this soon but before that this is my 2019 MacBook Pro. 8 core i9, 32 gigabytes of RAM, and 8 gigabyte graphics card. This thing is a powerhouse of a laptop. And to go along with that, we have an LG Ultra Wide, which is amazing for editing. If you're an editor, please, please do yourself a favor and get an Ultra Wide. And right here, we have a Keytron K2. I put some custom keycaps on it. Nothing crazy. Wireless, wireless. And this is a Logitech MX Master 3. I really, really like it. Literally, just my play button and some fake grass that I use for a background. Thank you, thank you very much for over. 100,000 subscribers. We're almost at 400,000, so if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. It would mean a lot. Seriously, guys, you guys have changed my life. Thank you. And back here, we got the homie Squidward, and then we got my lenses for my cameras. Lenses are really expensive. Like, I've spent more money on lenses than I have cameras. Don't get into photography. It's kind of a bad hobby. It's, it's a very expensive hobby. And a lot of people always ask about this sign. It's a custom neon sign that I got from I don't know where. Just look it up online. Look up custom LED signs, and you'll find stuff like this and before you go here's the scuff controller that I'm gonna be giving away pretty much brand new I've literally only used it once for a video but literally all you have to do is follow my Twitter it'll be linked down below and I'll be choosing one random follower to win this and again huge shout out to Dragon City for sponsoring this video there'll be a link down below make sure you guys download Dragon City completely free and if you're not already make sure to subscribe and thank you guys for watching peace